Love never fails because love decides who will get their love. Love decides what actions will take place. Love is an action word. So continue to love and continue to give one to another. So these three remain. Have faith. You're trusting in one another for good. Have hope that the future will be bright, which will continue to add energy and life to your day, and add love, which when all else fails, you still have each other and you still have the opportunity to give of yourselves to another. Amen. I once heard someone say that friends are the family you choose for yourself. If that is true, then I'm extremely lucky to have Randy and Jamie as part of my family. And the one thing I will say, Jamie, is if Randy turns out to be half as loyal and supportive as a husband as he has been a friend, then you can look forward to a very long and very happy marriage. Earlier this spring, we celebrated an anniversary down in Chicago. I'm getting all choked up. But we uh, celebrated a 60th wedding anniversary for my parents. Dean and Danita celebrated 32 years, and Deb and I, 33. So don't screw this up. <laughs> we got quite a trend going. I want to make you mine. You know, this is my only daughter, and I have one son. So this is kind of for both of you, because if you're a parent out there in the crowd, you get it. These kids, you, you bear them, you give them water, you give them food, they grow up. And they train us as parents, right? They give us a little bit at, at, at a time. So when they're teenagers, they start separating from us. They do their own thing. Then they go off to college. They really do their own thing. Then they then they they go hang out with some guy for a long time. <laughs> and you worry. You worry and you wonder and, and everything works out. Then they go off to Kansas City, Missouri. What in the world? Well then you know what? They finally got married and I I really am very happy for both of you. And I, I, I would just say a few things if I can read them. Family love, respect, and communicate. Good luck. I want to make you mine. First, I'm going to address my comments to Jamie. My dear Jamie, you have been my pretty little princess from the day you were born. I am blessed that God has allowed me to be the keeper of this magic wand which I sometimes like to think that is what I used to ease your tears and your fears, protect your heart, and celebrate all the joy that you have brought to our family. So with that, Randy, and with pride, joy, and a little sadness, I now hand over my magic wand to you. <laughs> I want to make you mine I, till the stars don't shine Finally you're here in front of me We've got all our lives We have here precious metal to signify that love isn't cheap. That's the point of our first ring. That love isn't cheap. It is good and it has value. So therefore, Randy, if you would take your bride's ring and while placing it upon her left hand, repeat after me. With this ring, with this ring, I thee wed. I thee wed. And with all that I am. And with all that I am. And with all that I have. All that I have. I honor you. I honor you. In the name of the Father. 
In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. And of the Holy Spirit. The secondary meaning we want to attach to these rings today is probably pretty common for wedding ceremonies. But nonetheless, the idea in 1 Corinthians 13 is that love never ends, love never fails. So on the one hand, love isn't cheap. It's the thing that endures forever. So Jamie, can you take this ring and place it upon your groom's left hand and repeat after me. With this ring, with this ring, I thee wed. I thee wed. And with all that I am, and with all that I am, and with all that I have, and with all that I have, I honor you. I honor you. In the name of the Father, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, and of the Holy Spirit. It is my pleasure that by the power of Almighty God, I can now pronounce you husband and wife, you may kiss the bride. I want to make you mine Ah, till the stars don't shine Won't you please be mine?